You're in the zone, the superhero zone, so let's get right into it. So as we continue to explore the multiverse saga and the MCU, yes, I'm choosing to call it the multiverse saga, deal with it. We will continue to be introduced to brand new characters that we have not seen before in the MCU. So in this video, this is my top six characters that I want to see in the MCU. Mild spoilers for Multiverse of Madness, but not really a spoilers at all. So let's get right into it. Number one on this list is Miles Morales. Ever since I saw Ultimate Spider-Man as a kid, it was the animated Disney XD cartoon. I loved this character and then seeing him in Into the Spider-Verse was amazing. By the way, Across the Spider-Verse comes out next year in like January, no, July or something. But yeah, can't wait to see that movie and I hope that movie bridges him directly into the MCU because it's rumored that uh, he, there's going to be like a live action cameo. So yeah, I hope we see this. Number two on this list that came very close to Miles was actually Quasar. Now, Quasar is one of the first Marvel characters I ever got to introduce to. Thanks to the Infinity War comics that I read, this was the first set of comics that I've ever read in my entire Marvel reading career. And he's a character that I really uh, enjoyed reading about. And uh, yeah, I hope we see him. He deals with like cosmic side of things and he interacts with Captain Marvel on a couple of different occasions and the wrist gauntlets that you see on his wrist, yeah, they give him his flight and blasty abilities. So I feel like he would be a very interesting character to add to the MCU and possibly Captain Marvel's arc and stuff. Number three on this list is Miss Hottie over here, which is Storm. Like I've had a crush on her for the longest time. Anyway, thanks to the Professor X cameo in Multiverse of Madness, we may actually get to see her sooner rather than later. And before, the death of Chadwick Boseman. She was actually confirmed to be in uh, the next Black Panther movie, but I hope we see her rather soon in future X-Men arcs. But pretty much everybody knows her powers. She can control basically any and all weather, including space-themed weather things like asteroids and stuff. Also, number four is a lesser known Marvel character. Her name is Songbird, AKA Melissa Gold. She has sonic powers right that generates her wings and her sonic powers can kind of sonic meaning she can sonic scream and she can make like a hammer up here and use a hammer or chains right she's an original member of the thunderbolt she led the thunderbolts at one time and she turned good and joined the avengers at one point and yeah she would be a very cool character she used to be able to sonic scream out of her throat but she had to get the neck a necklace that screams for her uh in place because she damaged her voice because of her powers number five is sam alexander right i love richard Ryder, but he's my favorite because of the ultimate spider-man cartoon everybody pretty much knows his powers nova is getting a solo project so we'll get to see a version of him sooner rather than later number six human tour specifically chris evans yes i watched the original fantastic four and loved it anyway yippee ki let's ride 